couples who agreed to swap their spouses in a bid to find what they referred to as happiness have returned with feedback, saying it has been the best decision they have ever made. It will be recalled that the adventurous couples from Kenya's Busia County embarked on the research for the said happiness in 2019. According to tuko.co.k, Christopher Buer, Bure and Lillian Weta have been together for more than a year after his ex-wife Immaculate Nekesa got married to Lillian's ex-husband Kevin Barasa in 2019. Christopher told NTV in an interview that taking Lillian Weta from Kevin Barasa in exchange for Immaculate Nekesa has transformed his life significantly. Even when you look at me, according to what he said, married to the other wife, I looked old, but now I look like a young man, an elated Christopher said. Lillian then emphasized by adding that she is now a happier woman with Christopher compared to when she was married to Kevin Barasa. For them, it has been happiness galore ever since they agreed to swap their spouses. He said, I am very happy. I'm a very happy woman. My children and myself live a good life, Lillian said. Interestingly, Kevin and Immaculate, who reportedly live in a nearby village, said their experience over the period makes nonsense of the saying that marriage is not a bed of roses. Some of the actions that this wife does for me, my other wife did not do them for me, is smiley Kevin said. In September 2019, when they made news headlines, rumors were rife that the men were having illicit affairs with each other's women. Reports say Lillian is a mother of three, while Immaculate Wekesa, 29, has two children from a previous marriage. Despite the switch, the four of them have kept contact for the sake of their children, whom they see once a month at the Busia Children's Department, tuko.school.k reports. The two couples met after one of the women brought up the bizarre idea of swapping and both parties peacefully agreed to the deal. Who? <laughs> Wonders shall never end. Hmm, let's hear what people are saying, you know, because this one, eh, if you ask me who I go come ask you, hmm, let's ask Nigerians on other people who uh, who have a one or two things to say. Incredible, Kenya. It is only in places like Kenya, Uganda, Zambia, Zimbabwe, and sometimes South Africa that you can hear these sort of bizarre stories. Immediately, I saw the headline. Oh, I knew it will be one of those countries. Their <laughs> their penchant for oddities oddities is legendary. Hmm. I don't see anything bizarre in that. So that's another same person's opinion. It is widely practiced in so many traditions, more worse in European countries, who choose to baptize such acts to call it something else. Yes, immediately I saw the headline. I knew it must be Kenya. <laughs> well, no news ever comes from Kenya than that doesn't sound like an abomination. Why call it an abomination? Somebody's asked. Okay. <laughs> well, um, pointed points, my brother. I tire for Kenya and East Africa. So, is what good news? Right? Maybe you are one of them. You may be a Nigeria with Kenya, Kenyan spirits. Uh, what a perversion. It is immoral. It should be discouraged entirely. In fact, it is totally, it's total insanity. Pure satanism. There is no satanism in that. Okay, you see, I told you we are going to be hearing a lot of a uh, inside this whole thing. Which abomination, another madness, happiness in, Amer in Africa. This is purely foolishness. Madness of the highest order. Black Africans are copycats. Gay we we copy. Lesbian will copy. Uh, Pemi a uh, to look like white. Now swap wives. We can't. Uh, we can't. Conscious enough. Michael. Uh, Michael Jackson starting turning Caucasians. Jesus intervene. We are also doing suicide to copy Arabs in northern Nigeria. Hmm. 
not encouraging low thinking idiots this is stupidity honestly why go for all legal battles for arranged divorce then across then cross over to marry a similar arranged divorce in order to remarry these uh, couples had expressed love interest for one another shortcut of switch over is fine and leaves no trace of enmity since both parties have agreed to coexist Bazungu shouldn't dictate to us their failed marriage system to Africans. Uh, African families are more stable than fake European families stick to culture. Mm. Ask is what he, the hell is this? <laughs> there is no hell in this. Well, some people said because they agree to that. Some people say it is satanic. It is it is unreasonable. They have been in love with each other of each other's wife secretly before now and they never love themselves nor their marriage anymore. Their spirit also doesn't accept to live together as husband and wife. Also, I advise that they should go for a DNA test of their children. I hope their families, community and society agree to the arrangements. <laughs> well, did they swap their children too? Good question. No, they said I did no, they didn't they didn't do that. Marriage should be honorable and bed undefied. Nice one. Let them continue. Total insanity. That is on a business. So one day on go swap hearts and organs. Nonsense. Madness. Sign of failed marriage. Good for now, but no triumph in Nigeria. Look at their faces. You can tell that they have an unstable mind. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this one is a professional to have seen somebody and just know um what the person looks like inside uh you see doctor you see doctor demons are at work at kenya are uh, dear christians in kenya they should stand against this amorphous and satanic relationship how come the women we accept this uh acts i don't think a woman normally can accept that it is it's on interest to her already adultery woe to those saying good is bad and bad is good they look Dehydrated and malnutrition are setting hmm, experiments. <laughs> this is ungodly. It is adultery. Uh, defiling. This is defiling the marriage habit. It will attract divine judgments in the era. This is not swapping. Abomination, ungodly, evil, and open adultery. Think of those children's future. It is like they have no brains but only water in their heads. Mm -hmm. Now, what are they in their head? So guys, let's say your opinion. Leave your comment below and let's know what you think about this. A lot of things are happening. You can say, ah, no, 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 no. Oh, even around you, things that you never thought of or envisaged are happening. Things are happening. <laughs>